click the import CSV button and then we're going to choose our file and there's a sample file there if you need it for reference and then we're going to map the columns in the CSV file to fields on the contact record so click start mapping columns and just go across we don't have to import every field we can skip fields that aren't going to make it into Memorin. We want to keep the header row. We don't want to allow blank email addresses in this case, so we click import and there's our summary of the import. If we had errors, they would show up there as well, so we can go back into the file and fix them. And there you have it, importing contacts from a CSV.